How do you think Randy Quarles is going to be? I mean, what, what, what sort of regulator do you think he's going to be? Well, I think he is someone who understands the industry, which is a nice change. Uh, we've been through eight years of what I call Spanish Inquisition <laughs> as a result of Dodd-Frank, particularly the mortgage industry. But the banks, too, have put, been put through a lot of hoops that, frankly, don't matter. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of Dodd-Frank was just retribution. It's Elizabeth Warren embodied. Mm. And so I think he'll be you greeted. You mean don't matter making banks safer? No, they want to punish people. And they, but what I mean by that is shareholders. The victims who, you know, who investors have been paying for this since 2010 when that law was passed. And what have we accomplished? We have more capital, but we didn't need more capital. Uh, we have fewer loans to risky projects. And I think there's a whole raft of things that Quarles is going to deal with. He's very credible. It's been confirmed by the Senate twice. I, I, you know, I don't see any, any, problems, any here. problems. And remember the vetting process. You guys have a great piece up on, on the website right now. And it, I know a lot of people who've been interviewed for these positions at the Fed. And they, they took a long time. Yeah. There is yeah. like 150 of them. Well, okay. So what most needs to be done? Do you, what do you think Donald Trump wants done? And again, specifically when it comes to Randy Quarles, mm -hmm. you seem to think he's the right guy. Why is he the right guy? Mm. Well, I think he's going to take a look at what Dan Tarullo did at the Fed. Tarullo is a very intelligent guy, but he didn't know a lot about banks. He attacked the problem he was given, and he came up with this very mechanistic regulatory structure with stress testing and, you know, all of which is in Dodd-Frank. You have to do it. Um, and I think now that we have a Republican Senate, Republican House, Randy Quarles is going to look at this, look at the industry and say, how can I accomplish most of the good that was in Dodd-Frank and trim back some of the things that really don't matter? And they take enormous amounts of time and money. Uh, living wills, for example, total waste of time. Uh, the stress tests, a media circus. We shouldn't do this in public anymore. Uh, the that crisis is going. over. Yeah. No, we, we should do it, and they should force banks to prove that they're going through the process of, you know, enterprise risk management. That's what we're talking about. That's a gating item for earnings. You have to prove to us you know what's going on, then we'll let you increase dividends or stock repurchase, right? Okay, fine, but we don't need to do it in public. That's a silly thing. And then there's a whole raft of other things, capital, okay. liquidity, all the pain points uh, that frankly have distracted banks for, for years.